good with them in a couple of days. So I honestly, honestly, really need this birthday to go well. I mean, I try my best now since I wasn't the best brother to him. And because of the past that Damien has, I'm double trying too. Just because, well, he's never had a childhood. And I guess with Tim, it's just easier because, you know, he's a nerd slash geek. He can take care of himself. And while all of us can, it's just, it's interesting. Anyway, okay, here we are, people. Meet back in the square by nine. So then we can go and pick up the cake, which is an hour away, which means we'll get there at 10 and we should be back we should be back in town by 11 back at wayne manor give or take with traffic at 11 30 which will be perfect for the plan soon we follow then we follow jason in to the thrift store hmm, what am i gonna get him Honestly, I don't know. I want to get him something nice. Memorable? I don't know. I don't know. I just... Oh, my gosh. By the way, we're listening to his inner monologue. I don't know. I just... I really want to make this gift special. Perfect, I guess. It has to be. I need it to be. It's just... Me and Bruce haven't been on the best, you know, place since... I've been, well, reincarnated, and also, after therapy, and it's just, it's, it's been hard, so I need to get him something absolutely perfect, absolutely beautiful, there it is, there it is, the present, that's it, that is the present, oh my gosh, it is, it was a picture of Bruce's favorite movie. It was the picture of Bruce's favorite movie with all the autographs from the main actors. Jason knew he would love it. He had gotten a score. Now, it was time to buy it and go and do some other things and... Look around some other places just in case it's not the home winner. <laughs> he had to. Now we follow Damien going into the store under the supervision of Tim. So, Damien, what do you think about getting father? Why would I tell you that? Okay, jeez. I know, I know, I know that it's been, well, interesting because we've all been competing for his love. Uh, competing obviously i am the one with true with all the affections don't forget i'm the blood son okay okay geez can we just get along together come on it's it's his birthday and and we promised dick that for his birthday this year we'd all get along so what are you thinking about getting him mm, i don't know maybe a new suit and tie maybe not I wanted to get him something nice. What are you thinking about getting him? Can't be much better than that. Uh, I don't know. I was working with a couple of things down in the Batcave. And working on some new computers. I talked to Lucius about some stuff. But he said they were going to be the distraction for the girls. So I guess that's out of the window. I don't know. I was thinking about new gear. But... I'm pretty much stopped. Do you want to give him a combined gift? That'd be pretty sweet. What are you thinking about? I don't know. Maybe something small. Sentimental? Small and sentimental? Really? He has everything in the world. And yet you want to give him something small and sentimental. Well, if it's small and sentimental, it will give him a sense of love. And love and happiness is a rare thing in all of our lives 
You have a point there, Drake. Okay. What will it be out of all of these things? Actually, what? I see something. What? A snow globe. It's really nice. It has a sword in it. Oh, well, that's cool. Actually, that's perfect. It's a perfect combined gift. And why is that? Well, it has a sword for you from League of Assassins, and it's a snow globe. And it represents the the winter that we went against, up against Penguin together that one Christmas. It was a really good, great holiday, actually. I enjoyed it a lot. So, do you want to get it? Yeah, sure. Uh, can you read how much it is? Yeah. Oh, that's really cheap. <laughs> Only $13. Wow, that's nice. Well, <laughs> they can say money can buy you everything. Can't buy you love. Isn't this sentimental? Oh, Damien, you have so much to learn. But anyway... Let's just buy this and probably get going. Okay, Dick. Don't overthink this. Don't overthink this. Don't overthink this. What would he want? The door opens. Oh my gosh. Here he is, the golden boy, trying to find the perfect gift. Really, Jason? Oh, I'm sorry, Dickie. Uh, didn't mean to, you know, chip your shoulder there. Okay, really? Why are you here? Well, I'm done finding my gift. And I figured I'd come down here to this nice, marvelous store of whatever these are. <laughs> They're records. Uh, records? Records? Why music records? Well, I, I don't exactly know. I, I thought I was going to get his favorite song or something. And favorite song. Favorite song. Oh, so now you're judging me. I'm sorry. <sighs> you know, maybe you shouldn't give him something like a favorite song. Just something sentimental. I mean, come on. He's... Rich, he has everything, except love in this life, and he could use some. Well, that's actually not a bad idea, Todd. <laughs> I'm not always that bad. Not all full of bad. You know? I, at least I didn't used to be. Well, come on. I know that. Even if Bruce doesn't know that. You probably got him something great, didn't you? Oh, nothing much. Uh, just this poster of his favorite movie that he always went to go and see in private screening with the main actor's um, signatures on it. Wow, that's, that's really great. Yeah, it's uh, collectibles. It's super nice. I, you know, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> It's just, I I figured I'd go in a couple other stores if you didn't like it. My gosh. Jason, stop, stop. It's perfect. Don't overthink it, bro. Oh, okay, I mean, I know that things have been rocky in you and Bruce's relationship. I get it. I get it. But that's the most beautiful present ever. Well, you need some help with yours? Yeah, we should probably head over to somewhere else. And somewhere else would be like, I I don't exactly know. Mm-hmm. Want to give him something edible? Nah. Nah. Too many people out to get us. Edible could be poisonous. You've got a good point. Okay, well. Oh my gosh. What? You know what? Let's let's um let's go over to the antique store. Uh okay. Well, I mean, you found him something vintage and I think small and sentimental is the way to go. 
And if it's not crazy, it won't kill him. Oh, you're thinking about the bat frog. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, can we not talk about that ever again? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, we can go. Um, whew. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Ding! The door opens. And in walks Dick and Jason. Now, right now, it is about... You know, what, nine? It's what? About 8.40? Yep, 8.40 right now. And they're supposed to meet back at nine. Oh, wow. We're really running short on time. Well, I guess you better hurry up, golden boy. Really? Okay, okay. <sighs> I'll try and remove the stick up my But uh, can we get a move on, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Hmm, let's see. Rustic antique face. Nah, probably a copy. We have one like that in the house. Something, something, something. Hi, old newspapers. Blah, blah, blah. <sighs> Some old memorabilia. Hmm. <laughs> Baseball team memorabilia. I don't really see anything. Oh, there it is. What? What? Oh my gosh. It's it's perfect. What's perfect? Uh it's hmm. It's a clipping. A clipping of what? It's a newspaper clipping. Of of the um of the gala ball that we that we went to actually and i wore those fake lips at <laughs> so then poison ivy couldn't touch me we kind of used it as an inside joke well let's get going man if that's the perfect gift it is okay well let's pay for it and get out of here it's nine fifty. it's a bit of a walk back I know, I know. Hey, do you want to drive up there for that one hour? I mean, if if you want to. Oh, oh, you know, um, uh, you know, if you, well, no, no, you know what? We'll figure this out later. Let's just get back, okay? Everyone meets back up at the square, and now they proceed to get in the car. Hey, girls, how is that, um, distraction coming? How much longer do we have? You know, can you still get us an hour? Uh, well, Broadway says in a quiet voice, uh, we're really trying to stall in here, but we just, um, computers are a little faster than they used to be. I think we're gonna have to come up with a little bit of a different plan, but as long as but as long as we're on this duty, I'm swear to you, we'll stall. Oh, what's up? Oh, yeah. Okay. Good news. Selena just got here. I guess she picked up our presents. Um, I I'd hurry up if I were you, though. Okay. Well. Guys, but in the pedal to the metal, we really, really got to get that cake and get back fast. Why? Why? The girls um are stalling, but I can sense it won't be for much longer. I hope there won't be any traffic on the way back to Wayne Manor. Me too. Well, I mean, <sighs> this would be... So much easier if it was on a weekday. Yeah, it kind of would be. Yeah, the naming just wouldn't go to school. <laughs> uh, well, okay. Let's go on. As track, as track tunes played out on 
on the radio in the car, we get to, we come to a stop, and we're at the cake place. Okay, guys, you know the plan. I go in, get the cake, pay for it, and then we have Tim hold it. Why is it Tim getting to hold it? Why not me? Because you are the designated gift watcher. Why do I have to be the Jackson Heat gift watcher? Because you have the quickest reflexes out of everyone. And we all got gifts that were somewhat very durable. Okay, okay. Okay. Ching, the door opens. Hey, one cake for Bruce Wayne, please. Oh, here it is. Thanks. That will be... $29.99. $29.99. Here you go. Thank you. Bye. Okay, Tim. Here's the cake. Protect it with your life. Uh, okay. I mean, protect it with your life. Uh, he clearly could not see the very, very importance of this cake. Everything is important this day. If I could just... In some way, make the relationship between Jason and Bruce a little better. He might just come to Thanksgiving. Yep, yeah, this is this happens before the interesting Thanksgiving, by the way. They speed home, and they make it right on time. Okay, girls, you hear? Yep, okay. Everyone places. Have the cake under here. Alfred's going to hold it. Every present is in place. He should be here around 30 minutes. If we have any decorating issues, we should fix them up now. Hey, Dick. Yeah, Jason? Uh, I think I'm going to head out. What? Yeah, well, I already got my stuff packed, and I just think it's better. But, but, no, no. But, uh, it just, this, his birthday seems super, super important to you, and... So does this, and I just, I don't want to ruin it, and... No, Jason, stay, come on. Um, I already have my stuff packed, and my my motorcycle's hooked up to, to my car. I'm just gonna... Really, Jason, come on! What, why won't you stay? It's just, it's, it's super awkward, and I don't want to ruin Bruce's birthday, or anyone. Just, just give him... M- my gift for me, please? Yeah, of, of course. Are you sure you're gonna go? Yeah, um... Just kind of gonna meet up with the outlaws at our point of designation. They got there early anyway. Uh, I'll see you guys later. <laughs>